Hi, I'm Jesse Sanchez from ELO Touch Systems. In this video, we'll be installing additional RAM on ELO's 1582 and 1782 all-in-one touch computers. The process is the same for both units. I'm going to be using the 1782 for the demonstration. Before we get started, there are a few things you need to know about memory modules. Be careful, improper installation and removal of a memory module can cause damage to your all-in-one. You should only use memory modules that are compatible with your all-in-one. ELO offers a memory module that meets the requirements for the 1582 and 1782 all-in-one touch computers. For your workspace, we recommend a clean and soft environment, something that won't damage the bezel or the screen. You can use a towel. I'm going to be using this rubber pad. We also recommend using an anti-static wrist strap. This is very important when handling the memory. You will need a Phillips head screwdriver. And if you have a long shank screwdriver, this will be very helpful when removing the base. In this kit, you will find two things you will need. First is a memory. Next is a quick start guide. This you're going to find very useful. This has photos and also diagrams just in case you get lost. So let's get started. First step you want to take is you want to turn the unit off. Second, flip the unit onto its face, remove the power cord, and then remove the back cover. You'll also need to remove the stand. There are four screws. Here's where the long shank screwdriver comes in handy. You can reach through the base to remove the screws along the back. Then remove the screws in front. Once you've removed the stand, you'll need to remove the four screws that hold on this panel. Then lift the panel off. This reveals the opening to the memory socket. To remove an existing memory module, pull the two metal latches away from the module until it's released. It should tilt up. It can then be safely removed. Take the new memory module, hold it at an angle, align it, and slide it in until it is well seated. Then push the module down until it clicks. Now you're ready for reassembly. Put the metal panel back in place and reinstall the four screws you set aside earlier. Reattach the stand. Replace the back cover insert. That completes the mechanical installation. To verify that the additional memory was installed properly, you may reattach the power supply, power on the touch computer, and use the operating system. Thanks for watching. See you next time.